rotten canned corn probably isn't at the top of your grocery list, but could it wind up in your cart? If you're shopping at Sam's Club, you might want to rethink these staples. At 4.2 stars, the Members Mark Solid White Albacore Tuna in water doesn't seem like such a bad deal. However, the product has complaints of unwanted ingredients, while others say there is too much to eat at one time. Sam's Club is a bulk buy warehouse, but tuna is one of the things that you'll want to use immediately after opening the can, and more than 66 ounces is a lot of tuna. An additional complaint focuses on the shipping and notes that the cans were dented. This seems to be a consistent problem that shows up with most of the Members Mark tinned foods, but for something like canned tuna, a dent would be especially bad. Not only would the product leak, but the tuna odor would escape the can as well. You might consider purchasing this in person to ensure you get a can that isn't dinged. If you really want to be annoyed at people who rate products, Members Mark Mandarin Oranges is the product for you. These mandarin oranges, sold in a large 105-ounce can, are rated at 4.5 stars with numerous 1, 2, and 3-star ratings, and absolutely no reviews for any of them as of September 2022. Listen, if you're going to leave a negative rating on a product's webpage, please have the courtesy to say why you're giving the product a lower rating. Be a good customer. Look at this! Got a little VIP lounge for me. Guys, he's doing it again. You smell that? That's VIP air. Members Mark Mandarin Oranges are also sold in a 10-pack of 15-ounce cans, and these, thankfully, have some reviews along with the lower ratings. Complaints include too much juice and not enough fruit, objections that the fruit was bitter-tasting, claims that there was a lot of peel, and one comment about how the oranges were a lower-grade fruit. That's not exactly promising. The majority of members' marked canned goods that are currently available are tomato products. The complaints vary greatly and often appear to be due to personal taste, at least when you can spot an actual review. For members' Mark whole peeled tomatoes and tomato juice in the 102-ounce can, there really aren't many reviews or ratings to start with. The product still gets 4.5 stars overall, and there are only a handful of reviews for the 1, 2, and 3-star ratings. Still, the complaints are food for thought, with some saying that the product is too watery, has too much sodium, and is never available. Excess sodium can be a problem in canned goods, and normally you should always rinse canned vegetables and beans, which would remove things like sodium from the surface of the canned food in question. This, unfortunately, doesn't work that well for peeled tomatoes and juice. Members Mark Diced Tomatoes and Juice comes in a 102-ounce can, with numerous ratings of 1, 2, and 3 stars. The biggest complaint is that the product is too watery. Luckily, the soupiness is easily overcome by just draining the juice from the can. Diced tomatoes themselves tend to remain with better texture in the can because of a firming agent that's added to the food. There is also a problem that just comes with canned tomatoes no matter the brand. Canned diced tomatoes are cooked, so their texture will be different from fresh tomatoes no matter what you do. Despite its 4.5-star rating, the Members Mark Cut Green Beans, available as a 12-count pack of 14.5-ounce cans, has some troubling reviews. We've eaten from these tins of mystery for years now, haven't we? Many of the reviews complain that the beans are excessively stringy and mostly stems. The texture of the beans are described as overly fibrous and not at all what you might expect. In all, about eight reviews have qualms about stringiness in one form or another, so you may want to be prepared for that if you buy this product. It's not exactly known why green beans turn out so stringy. According to Gardening Know How, excessive stringiness is a sign that beans were picked too late. However, according to Organ Live, that justification hasn't been confirmed as the real reason why some green beans end up so wiry. At 4.5 stars overall, Members Mark Tomato Sauce in the 106-ounce can is one of the lower-rated Members Mark products, but 4.5 out of 5 stars is still pretty darn good. However, many of the negative reviews mention dented cans. How much of a deal-breaker is that? According to the University of Wyoming Extension, minor dents aren't a big deal, but extensive damage means it's safer to just get rid of the can. Other complaints call the product too salty or too watery and say that it seems like the product has been switched, meaning that the name was the same, but the product inside has changed. Changed. The canned tomato adventure continues with another version of Members Mark Tomato Sauce. The 12 pack of 15 ounce cans get 4.6 stars, but customers have also claimed the product is too sweet and unsuitable for sauce. Another review calls the sauce too bland, while others complain about an awful smell. Severe discoloration, rusted cans, and an abundance of the negative reviews mention most or all of the cans being dented. While there were many positive reviews, this one might warrant some careful consideration. Sam's Club carries canned chicken in a 50-ounce size, and the good news is that it's one of the most convenient and nutritious foods you could hope to find wrapped in metal. There are a lot of reasons why you should always have canned chicken in your pantry. However, this particular product puts even those into question. Overall, the product has 4.6 stars, but the more negative reviews include criticisms about a possibly spoiled batch where the meat had an oily texture and off-putting odor, as well as many complaints about dented cans. Some reviewers didn't want such a big can, having to throw away the remainder of the product 
If you decide to buy this product and find yourself swimming in chicken, you can freeze the portions you can't eat quickly. Still Tasty puts the shelf life of frozen, canned chicken at one to two months, but also says that this describes quality only. If the freezer is working properly and the chicken is kept at zero Fahrenheit or below, the USDA says meat should remain safe to eat past that brief time span. In the same realm of canned chicken, six count of 12.5 ounce cans of Members Mark Premium Chunk Chicken Breast gets 4.6 stars and actually a lot of compliments for the chicken itself. People like the product, but recent reviews show many, many complaints about how much the price has gone up, with one person even stating they're buying rotisserie chickens from now on. Maybe you should go for a freshly roasted chicken yourself, especially considering how many options there are for picking up a delicious rotisserie chicken. Members Mark Pineapple Tidbits in the 107-ounce can get generally good ratings with 4.7 stars. Still, it has a handful of 1 and 3-star ratings with no reviews, leaving potential consumers guessing why former shoppers didn't like the product. It doesn't get much better when you look at the higher ratings also having no reviews. Add in the fact that there are plenty of other options for pineapple, and it's safe to say that this one should be a no-go. Another option for canned tropical fruits is the 107-ounce can of Members Mark Tropical Fruit Salad. This has a few ratings of 1, 2, and 3 stars. And only two of those have accompanying reviews. One reports a chemical-like taste, and the other thought the fruit was too hard to eat on its own, but might work when blended for a smoothie. And again, the higher ratings don't have much written about them either. That said, this is another product where you may not have much to go on, save for the general sort of idea that this isn't the same kind of tropical fruit salad you might make at home. Tomatoes make another appearance here, this time as the Members Mark Crushed Tomatoes in Tomato Puree. This 105-ounce can gets 4.8 stars overall, but the content of the negative reviews is worth some consideration. They all complain about texture. One called the product bland and watery, so much so that it just didn't work in their recipe. Another negative review gives a little history of the product. The customer wrote that they used to buy another brand that Members Mark replaced and that since then, the texture has been off. The customer review points out that the product was more like chunks of tomato instead of the crushed pureed mixture that most brands use. Another customer agrees, also noting the appearance of tomato skins in the mixture. There's a genuine difference between crushed tomatoes and diced tomatoes, so if you need that distinction to be clear, skip this can. And it's also worth mentioning that this product seems to suffer from the same problem that many Sam's Club cans get called out for, crushed and dented cans. The 12-pack of 6-ounce cans of Members Mark Tomato Paste has some odd reviews. The product itself has 4.8 stars, so this is one canned tomato product that isn't doing too badly, or so it seems. One review claims the labels on the cans were printed upside down, which led to the customer initially trying to use a can opener on the bottom of the can, and another declares the tins had no label at all. A further reviewer says the Best Buy date had no year, just a month and day. Assuming the date was not using a calendar code that the customer couldn't interpret, we can imagine it would be a bit distressing to find that there is no way to tell when a product's quality will start to decline. Best Buy dates may be guidelines, according to the USDA, but that doesn't mean you want to take chances that the quality of a product you just bought actually started declining last year. If you buy this product, ensure the labels are on correctly and look for a fully printed Best Buy date. If that's missing, that's just not a good sign. You're eating eight-year-old tomatoes. They're still good for another week. You know, I think I might have some type of cheese in the back of my fridge you might like. Corn on the cob is delicious but difficult. Canned corn is a marvel. You can snack on it, cook with it, and even use the water it's packed in for soup. You can even upgrade your canned corn by dressing it up with spices and sauce for a salad you'll love to eat. The wonders of corn taken into account, it's rather disappointing to find that Members Mark Whole Kernel Sweet Corn has a lot of complaints about texture. The product has 4.7 stars overall, but reviews complain about the corn being tough to chew, rotten, and with a flavor that was not at all what it should be, especially considering the potential that corn has. Quite a few comments point out that the carton, not the shipping box but the carton holding the 12 cans, was in good shape, yet the cans inside were all dented. That implies denting happened somewhere in the production process, not through shipping. If you want to buy canned corn at Sam's Club, be careful, especially if those reviews are accurate. Keep a close eye on the recent reviews and see if the complaints about dents taper off. So if you guys want to clap, this is the time.